What's up guys, it's Diamond Creeper, and today we're going to be building this Metrolink Hyundai Routeam uh, commuter car. Now this is actually a passenger train that was actually used in the uh, Southern California, and yeah, this is actually what it looks like. And basically, if you want to know what it looks like in real life, I have a train set with the uh, locomotive at 59 PHI, uh, with the uh, <coughs> uh, ribbon uh, pink scheme, that was actually my favorite paint scheme for the F-59 BHI. That pulls with the uh, full uh, passenger train. And yeah, this is actually what it looks like. Pull, uh, pulling pulls the uh, the routine by hand the bi-level coach car. And the bi-level coach car, the original one, the oldest one that was actually built in the in 90s. And, and then we're going to all go all the way out on the back. And you'll see the, uh, the commuter car at the back. But yeah, this is actually what it looks like, and it's commissioned to my best friend Eden, so thanks to him for making this video. Now, actually, uh, this is actually uh, his uh, his favorite train, because he every time if I say uh, Metrolink, he actually it gets crazy, like, scream, I don't know. But, um, yeah, this is actually what it looks like, and basically, this is actually the uh, 2022 uh, new design for the locomotive for the train train over the passenger commuter car because uh, a lot a lot a lot of different changes you can actually see because some of the windows and the paint scheme are actually super changed and now it's actually ma made to my own design like the wheels and the bogies and the paint scheme it is all much detail and it kind of looks realistic but yeah and same thing to the other side and one thing about this locomotive is that at the front for the uh, commuter car, it has like a longest uh, windows on this side, and instead of using the original uh, windows like this, like the other ones, but yeah, and <coughs> and uh, right under here, I think there's actually events under here at the at this uh, direction, but I really have no idea. And this is actually what it looks like at the at the top. It has like the uh, like events and some numbers on the top. And that's pretty much it on this uh, locomotive. So first off, we're gonna be starting with the passenger train and then the commuter car. So yeah, let's get started. So first off, you're gonna have to grab your materials. Grab light gray concrete, stone slab, uh, polished inside slab, uh, brown terracotta, gray and stone. Another brick slab, dark oak fence gate, another brick wall, and what else? What else do we need? And a stone brick. So take out brown, brown terracotta, you're gonna have to skip two. Start from here, skip two, place one, and the other side. Then skip three, and then a stone brick slab. And then after that, in the middle, dark oak fence gate. Make the bogey. Same thing to this side. And then stone slab. You're gonna have to make it 21 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Then you're gonna have to make it 5 blocks wide. And then it should be looking like this. Alright. Now you're going to have to take a polish and side slab. You're going to have to skip two. Place two right here. And the other side. And at the back, you're going to have to skip three. And the other side. Round your cut off. My voice is actually a little bit different if I talk calmly. It kind of sounds like I'm whispering because I'm still a little bit sick. Like I have a cold fever. Thank God I don't have the coronavirus uh, fever. I only have the cold. And then it should be looking like this. Now take a library concrete. You're going to have to place two of them on this side. 
then we're gonna have to make it uh, 35 box long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. We're gonna have to make it 5 blocks wide. And same thing the, to the other side until you reach at the end. Alright, once you've done it, uh, we're gonna have to take out uh, some of the materials. But first, we're gonna edit the light gray concrete where the direction is. So we're gonna have to come right here to the doorway right here. We're gonna have to skip two, remove three, place it to the background. Then we're gonna come right here. And then same thing at the other side at the back. Then remove right here. Skip four. And then should be looking like this. Then take out a uh, dark oak trap door, another brick fence, spurge fence gate, and spurge sign. Dark oak trap door, same thing at the other side. Spurge sign, an ornament, uh, spurge fence gate, with a coupler. Trap door. Then another brick wall. <coughs> then it should be looking like this. Now after that, you're gonna have to take out a uh, polish and sights log. This one right here, and the other, and at the back, the other side, and then polish and side stairs. All right, and then it has to be like that. Skip four right here to this direction. Then underneath, we're gonna have to cover it with light gray uh, concrete. Same thing on the other side at the back. Then you're gonna have to take out some of the materials for the uh, paint scheme. So take out prismarine brick slab, uh, <coughs> warped fence gate, warped trap door, black concrete, uh, siren concrete, and then a warped fence, <coughs> and then a uh, prismarine brick stairs. So place the prismarine brick stairs like this. And then at the other side right here, we're gonna have to make the window. Black <coughs> warped stair trap door. Take out light gray concrete. All right. And then you're gonna have to cover the background with three blocks.
blocks long. Then I take out black concrete. Dark first marine slab. Uh, warp and find skate. Warp and trap door. Then you're gonna have to place three. Then a warp and find skate. Uh, prismarine brick slab. Prismarine brick stairs. Have the background to this to make the window. All right. And then it should be looking like this. Now take a cement or concrete. Place it to each side where the direction should be. And come right here. Black concrete. Prismarine brick stairs. Put trap door. And then take out light gray concrete. Then you're gonna have to cover the background right here to this side. direction okay place to this side and then take out a Bruce marine bricks Slab and then warp it from skate. It's actually the same thing as to, as to this side, but it's actually flipped. And then to this side. Place a black concrete for the windows. <coughs> Uh, work it. Uh, I meant f uh, uh, prismarine brick stair a uh, slab. Then uh, work the fence. Prismarine brick slab. Okay. <coughs> so 
sorry about that. Then you're gonna have to take out a Warped Stairs for the Metrolink logo. Hold the fence. And then it has to be like that. And I'll take a Warped Trap Door. And to this side. Okay. Yep, it's definitely to this side. Okay. And then take a leg ray concrete. Stuff from here. And to this side. Take out black concrete. And same thing with the other side. It should be looking like this. Alright, now we're gonna have to take out some of the materials for the roof. Take out stone brick stairs, smooth quartz stairs, uh, white concrete, another brick wall, black stained glass, oak trap door, iron bars. A dark oak button and then take out a light gray carpet, white concrete, smooth quartz stairs, stone, stone brick stairs. Then you're gonna have to cover the background. I meant, I meant to cover the roof. You're gonna have to go all the way until you reach at the end, but B, you're gonna have to be patient. Smooth quartz stairs. And then we're gonna make the same thing out to this side. Alright, after that, um, you're gonna have to take out a uh, iron bars, place it to this side, and the other side, and at the back, and right here. Okay, and then at the at the back to this side. All right, dark oak button. All right. gonna have to take out some uh, dark button place it to the to the place that we're gonna uh, where it's supposed to be oh forgot to place the uh, sorry turn cut off okay and it should be looking like this should be look like this 
Now take out a light grey concrete. Take out light concrete, place it to the background, and same thing to the f to the front or back. Now take out black concrete. Smooth stone. Now brick. Light grey carpet. Make it a square shape. Same thing to the, to the back. All right. Now take a bridge fence gate. And the other side. <coughs> Come right here to this direction. And the other side. Bricks. Uh, another bricks. And then you're gonna have to take out another brick stairs. Upside down. And then to this side. After that, take out birch fence. We're gonna make the details, so take out some birch button, crimson button, birch fence, uh, dark oak button, another brick fence, dark oak fence gate, dark oak trap door, and oak button. Dark oak trap door. Then take out smirch fence gate with the coupler facing that direction. And then take out stone button in the other side. Birch button, a birch fence gate, a birch fence. Place it to this side, skip one and then repeat. Take out birch button. Okay. Now you're gonna have to uh, come skip uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come to the middle, place it to, to a dark oak button right here. <coughs> That's for the uh, for the number. There's a button, a uh, dark oak, I meant oak button, and then dark oak button. Same thing to the other side. Hold on, let me take a look. Alright, once you've done, uh, take out and side wall, place it to this side and the other side. And then after that... Take out a spurge sign. Place it right here. You can use the debug stick if you have it because it turns out uh, in vanilla Minecraft you can actually 
you can get a debug stick so you're gonna have to do the uh, the buttons for the for yourself because it's really easy then take out a crimson button place it right here birch birch button and to this side <coughs> some button and then you're gonna have to take out a, a warp it button birch button and then a final touch birch button underneath here And that's pretty much it on how can you make the Metrolink uh, Hyundai the per, uh, the passenger tr uh, the passenger car. So let's move on to the to the cap car. Okay, so eventually I have to copy the the uh, the passenger car to uh, play uh, to make the cap car. So because it's basically the uh, actually the same thing. So we're gonna edit the paint scheme and the the shape. So take out some of the materials and then. We're gonna have to make this uh, boogie like a, a move a little block uh, goes to the other. We're gonna have to move it a little bit. So t so yeah. So start from here. We're gonna have to remove this direction. walkable and then after that we're gonna uh, take out some <coughs> like very concrete oh I forgot to place a uh, black concrete at the background for the passenger coach sorry my bad and then we're gonna have to remove some of the details and just remove that. Alright, and then take out uh, Prismarine Bricks uh, stairs, place it this direction facing the other direction, then cover it with like uh, concrete. Over the background all right the other side is actually the same thing because but it's reversed again like I said, prismarine brick slab. Prismarine brick uh, slab, and then take out warp it trap door. Okay. So you take out uh, prismarine brick stairs, make it upside down, and then a uh, prismarine brick slab. Okay. 
center and starting concrete. <coughs> warp and fence gate. Warp and trap door. A brick slab. Prismarine, a uh, brick slab. Deck out sign terracotta, a sign concrete. Warp it stairs. Then come right here. So the concrete. Oh, <laughs> facing the other direction. And then a warp at slab. So the concrete. Then you're gonna have to take out a wet concrete to cover the background for this. Okay. Like gray concrete. And I have to make sure that everything is covered. And right here. Okay. Remove an iron bars. You're gonna have to move the wheels like uh, one box long and one box uh, ahead <coughs> because there is actually a uh, a little one block space right here. So you're gonna have to do it the, uh, do it by yourself because this is really easy. And then take out another brick stairs just to this side, and then take out. Another brick slab. A uh, brick fence. Brick fence skate. And then a bedrock. Place it in the middle. Black concrete. Place the black concrete in the middle. Just remove these. Have to cover it, replace it. And then take out birch fence, replace it with the warp fence. Same thing to this side. Alright. Light gray concrete, prismarine brick slab, warp and fun skate, uh, nope. And side wall, <coughs> black concrete, and that's about it. And then you're gonna have to take a bridge fence. Every concrete. Warp it stairs upside down. 
then like brick concrete, prismarine brick slab, and take out perfect fence gate. And a prismarine brick stairs. Or fifth fence skate. Oh, whoops. Wrong direction. Okay. Fence. Nope. Another brick as uh, another brick stairs. Black concrete. Yeah, it should be looking like this. Same thing to the other side. Let me see the, to the front side of the vent. Prismarine wall. Place okay, so it to this side. Place it to, uh, to this uh, direction. <coughs> Legger concrete. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Another brick stairs. Upside down. And to the other side. Or pit stairs. Man, it's been like a, a while since we're still building this. Or a fence gate. Or a bit stairs right next to it, upside down. Or a fence gate. Again, skip two, place one, place two brick, br uh, prismarine bricks, like brick concrete, uh, prismarine brick slab. Concrete, prismarine brick slab, and right here. Till we reach here, cover the background. Move three. Okay, and place two. The background with cyan concrete. Uh, here's a brick slab. Warp a trap door. Oops. 
expect the slab to go upwards and then to this side uh, brick stairs <coughs> Prismarine brick slab. Then it should be looking like this, and then we're gonna make the Metrolink logo. We're gonna have to cover the background and same thing to the other side. Let's start with Warped Stairs. And then we're going to have to uh, do the same thing at the other side. But it's flipped. Okay. And then take out a dark oak button. Place it another one right here. And then a light gray concrete. black concrete uh, another brick stairs take out a gray concrete gray stained glass paint dark oak fence gate and then take out a another brick wall Black concrete. Dark oak fence gate. And then take a glow iron frame. Skip one and then place two. Take a birch sign. Dark oak fence gate. And then a birch fence gate. And bars. And the other side. Black concrete. Dark oak fence gate. Light gray concrete. Barriers. Command description, lever, the wipers, and then a dark oak sign, spurge fence gate, spurge sign, uh, oak button. Another brick fence, red stained glass, white stained glass, <coughs> and then take out birch fence gate, skip to place right here, and then come right here, place it to the side, and to this side. A little bit different, you're gonna have to place it to the direction of the vents. And then, after that, we're gonna make the details to so take out some of the materials warp it button, crimson button, birch button, dark oak button. Then take out Warped Stairs.
Search button. Dark oak button. Nope. Birch button is right here and right here. Crimson button. Birch button. Okay, that one is done. Crimson button. I'm just remove these uh, details. Oh, dark oak uh, uh, place dark oak button and a birch button underneath right here. And one right here. Underneath here, skip one, place one, and then a crimson button, dark oak button, no warp it button. Birch button, skip one, place crimson button. see is there anything else I just missed take out a uh, stone button place it right here I think that's pretty much it on how can you make the Metrolink uh, commuter car. Yep. And that's pretty much it on how can you make the the Metrolink uh, a Hyundai routine commuter car look like the bi-level coach car. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. And I hope this video helps a lot on uh, how can you make this uh, train a commuter car for Metrolink that was used in the Southern California. And it's actually commissioned by it's my best friend Eden. So thanks everyone for making this video possible again. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, if, uh, if you want to see uh, more videos like this, uh, please leave a comment down below. So which one on one of these vehicles you wanted you wanted me to see and to uh, make. Well, and that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day, you all. Uh, bye.